welcome back to week 44 of the Iron Man Road to Completion Escape series. Starting off for this week, doing exactly what I did at the end of last week. Um, I've actually been recording all kinds of stuff this morning uh, in preparation for that next series. Uh, I'm starting it today, even though I'm not actually going to be continuing it until later. Uh, just getting some stuff knocked out of the way. It's because some weird stuff is going on with my account there. Whatever. Um, yeah, so uh, just doing some more mining, and I'm about to pick up a virtual level, so I thought I should record that. Uh, there we go. That is mining level 107 virtual. And it's now really late in the day. Been doing this mining thing all day, uh, and uh, almost done three entire siphons, but uh, getting too tired, gonna go to sleep, so I've done two complete siphons, and then this one that's almost complete, uh, 64k there, and you can see I've got nine here in my inventory, also a really nice stack of corrupted ore, but these nine siphons are gonna finish off invention for me, uh, I'm just gonna keep doing this until I get down to the last one, uh, which will allow me to, uh, well, go work on this Hydrix Dragon task, or gemstone dragons, and uh, right here, yeah, this uh, offhand chaotic crossbow is like 3k XP away, so I'll just finish it up there, um, then I won't even have to finish up the Slayer daily, turn that in, uh, so I can keep getting dungeoneering dailies by the time I fin- or after I finish invention, and uh, yeah, got some things planned out, then I'm gonna move on to dungeoneering, um, I can start doing some more of that tomorrow, knock out most of that level, uh, going for 117. And it's time to pick up that second to last invention level. Bam! 119. Only a few more siphons to go. Still doing this mining thing. Uh, did a little bit of Dominion Tower earlier. And man, that, uh, that is not a fun mini game. I'm up to like 125 kills now or something like that out of 450. And, uh, yeah, I'm not looking forward to the rest of that, but at least it's not dungeoneering. Just been doing a little bit of a combat grind today, and, uh, well, I did some treasure trails. Ended up with these various things. Gotta make myself a, uh, dragon square shield, and add the ornament kit to it to actually get the, uh, uh fortunate component. So I'm just gonna add that, get that nice little pretty shield. I bet it's gonna go by. Bam! Disassemble that for a fortunate component. Here's another one. Fury Ornament Kit. Then a uh, Ancient Cloak and a Ceridoman Bow. Come on. There's that one. And there's that one. Uh, so with all of those, I'm at 42 components. So uh, fairly close to that... Uh, Luck of the Dwarves. Now look, I mean, I may be criticized for this. It's about to be some really bad XP waste, okay? But I'm gonna siphon this thing that's only 3k XP off of level 12. Just so that I can pick this up right now. Yeah, that's, that's a pretty good one right there. Time to go pick up that kit. Wait, I was told you can buy 120 capes in here. Let's see about that invention no nope, no not the 120 cape maybe I can uh, go pick it up from uh, Falador invention guild let's see let's discuss skill mastery I've noticed now I've mastered the skill is there anything else let's let's see there buy the invention master cape Oh, that beautiful Master Cape. Probably the most common of them. Nice. All the particle effects. Yeah. Rocking that there. Just gonna pop this in here. You know, for Fashionscape. Uh, I think that means I have to go do a lot of Dungeoneering now. Um, probably gonna take breaks from time to time. Go work on that, uh, you know, Dominion Tower. The Livid Farm. And the runecrafting I have to do with Livid Farm. But yeah, only a little bit left to go. Oh, and I just hit 2715. That's the old level before they added 120 Slayer. Um, 
Nice. Just started uh, Dungeoneering Grind, you know, right after I hit 120, and I just remembered that I'm going to have to go do, like, a few hundred Barrows kills. And, yeah, my day just got a little bit worse. So I have been really going at that Dungeoneering today, and uh, about to spend my, like, 400k tokens that I've earned up uh, between last night and this morning. Bam! That's going to pick me up uh, 117 Dungeoneering, and I've got a daily challenge to turn in, but hey, at least I've got floor 59 now. Only, uh, oh gosh, like 27 million to go. Well, uh, just gonna call it quits for the night. 24.9 mil left to go for 120, and that's uh, 6.2 mil to 118. Um, yeah, I'm hoping to have this done by Sunday, more or less. Uh, today is... Well, it's Tuesday now. It's Monday. That's day 305. Day 306 is going to be Tuesday. Um, yeah, so hopefully it'll be done by the weekend. Starting off today with a little bit of Barrows. I've done two runs so far, and I just got a Guthans Chain Skirt. Uh, I think I already have another piece of that set, so that's a pretty good find for me. And, uh, yeah, hopefully I'll be able to knock out like 100kc today, something like that. Get me a lot closer to that... Uh, well, you know, I brought your stuff back. So just turned in my uh, Dungeoneering Daily Challenge. Been doing a lot more Dungeoneering after my, like, hour of Barrows, maybe hour and a half this morning. Um, yeah, the Guthans piece was, was all I ended up getting, uh, the one that I showed in the last clip. Um, but, yeah, I uh, according to my spreadsheet, whenever I'm accounting for daily challenges, I only have about 50 hours left of Dungeoneering, so that's a pretty good milestone, as well as uh, 580 mil XP. I uh, thought that was noteworthy, down to only 50 hours left in this long-ass skill. And yet another day goes by with loads of Dungeoneering, um... This skill is just... Oh, man. <laughs> uh, so I've decided that I'm going to be making a guide on it. Um, probably a fairly comprehensive guide on Dungeoneering. Uh, yeah. So that'll be something to expect probably before I comp. Maybe even this week. Uh, but it'll probably come out next week. Like, right before the, uh, the comp video goes up. Um... Anyway, here's going to be all of my tokens, 648,000 of them, to pick up 118. Uh, that's something, gotta do my card, and go do some of my other, well, the only other daily that I do, uh, reversing Phoenix is a waste. Yeah, so there's 118. Um, also, I remember mentioning in the past that I was going to do a, like, comprehensive Iron Man guide. Um... It's probably not going to be as in-depth as I originally thought, uh, but it will be something that I'll definitely do. Uh, it's something that I feel I, I probably should do. Like, if I were to start another Iron Man account today, how would I go about doing it? Uh, especially with all of the new content that's been added and stuff like that. Plus, I wasn't, like, anywhere near as efficient as I could have been. I mean, I have 108 mining 107 HP... 107 magic yeah i could i could have done a lot better than that not really better on the hp level but much better in general um uh, anything good from the maw well okay yeah so that's basically the only dailies that i do is uh that um Vizwax and the claim a card uh plus my daily challenge yeah all right back to Back to DG, I guess, or go to get my uh, my daily Vizwax. Oh, and that entire last clip was for day 307, not for day 306. My bad. I said back to Dungeoneering, but actually gonna knock out some Livid Farm, uh, just because I feel like a change of scenery, really. Uh, yeah, so apparently they made Lunar Lumber and Lunar Fence Post stackable, uh, which is really nice. It gives you... Kind of something to do in between the cycles if you're not going to be uh, doing broads or something like that. Uh, also, apparently they increased the XP rate here. It seems like it gives more farming XP. Not entirely sure what all they changed. Uh, don't think they affect they, they changed the points rate at all. 
But, um, hey, at least uh, this right here comes in handy and makes things a little bit easier to do here. So I'm not quite going to say that it's the uh, next day yet, or the last day of this week, uh, because I'm, well, I'm pulling an all-nighter, and it's like 4 a.m., but I have been working at this for uh, quite a while. So, claim rewards, bam, spiritualized food at 200k, and uh, little black screen, da-da-da, claim rewards, 250k as well for make leather. Um, I think I started at 150k, so I just sat down and did 100,000 produce points in one sitting. Uh, I think I'm going to keep doing a little bit more, and then I might go back to engineering. I'm not sure. Hell, I might even just go to sleep, even though it is like 4am, but, uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. So, still doing that livid farm grind. Uh, yeah, it's the last day of this week. Don't know if I've mentioned that yet. Um, yeah. I'm gonna complete it. You'll see that in the next clip. Uh, it will actually be done and taken care of. May as well claim what I've already earned, though, since I'm gonna talk on something for a little bit. Uh, yeah, so I live in Texas, and there's a hurricane approaching. So there may be some real issues with this series completing. Uh... Yeah, so hopefully my power doesn't go out for more than, like, a day or two at the very best. Um, I'm really hoping there's no evacuation or anything called for. Uh, yeah, but ultimately I have to complete everything by September 5th or else 120 Slayer becomes a requirement and there's, like, another month and a half of grinding for me uh, that I'm not looking forward to. So, yeah. Um, I'm just gonna try to knock out stuff as fast as possible. Uh, next week is probably going to be a lot of dungeoneering, but, you know, if there's no hurricane or anything like that uh, causing me issues, I've also got school starting next week, so, um, uh, yeah, I'm gonna work on all of the things that aren't dungeoneering, um, well, no, I'm gonna get dungeoneering to 119, uh, then work on everything else, which means, uh, that I'll keep participating in the dungeoneering dailies. Uh, that'll help me take care of a bit of a bit more of that requirement. I think um, I get an extra 18k a day or something like that by getting to 119 instead of 118. Um, yeah, and then just see what I can do. Uh, I'm gonna try my best to knock everything else out. Um, I think I've listed it off a few times before, and, but for those who don't know, it is Barrows. Uh, which is, you know, we brought your stuff back for the achievements here. Yeah, Mauritania task set. Uh, then I've got the desert task set to complete, which ultimately uh, relies on me getting 450 kills in Dominion Tower. I'm currently sitting at like 106 or 110, something like that. So that's another eh, two days of grinding, probably. Um, hopefully I can knock it out faster than that. Uh, Barrows, that's another like day of grinding. Um, and then... It is just my boss kills, and Livid Farm here is done. Got to do Bones to Peaches, which is probably just a day of grinding. Uh, it might be a little bit more, I'm not actually sure. I keep forgetting about that one. Um, yeah, it should be fine, though. I, I watched Bodhi do it in his OSRS series, so uh, yeah. Uh, then I've got the Annihilator title. That'll be pretty easy. Uh, defeat every boss once for the Reaper. Uh, should be able to sort that out, especially if I'm really close to comp. A lot of people are probably going to be willing to help me. Um, Rush of Blood. That should be pretty quick if I get lucky. Get the right mobs. Then, um, yeah, my Rick Memorial. That's easy. That's like less than an hour. Uh, the Famous. That one's probably an hour, maybe a little bit more. And then I'm done. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll see if I can do that in the next, like, week and a half. Um, <laughs> wish me luck, I guess. Yeah, that's, that's no lie, that's 100 farming. I, I really messed up some things in this series, I think. That's just super inefficient to see that my last skill to 99 is now one of the only ones above 99. Today has been incredibly long, but finally, 
I'll be able to bunch these two, throw them down, and bam, claim borrowed power. Oh, finally! Yes! Oh, it's complete. Oh, man. Lunar Master. I mean, really, it was only like three days of play worth of grind. So I'm not that much of a master, but I am someone who suffered through it. Uh, and with that, that's the end of this week, guys. Week number 44. Uh, hopefully, I'll be done around week 45, maybe the beginning of week 46. There's no way. Uh, <laughs> there's no way I make it to the end of week 46 and finish the series, because uh, that's after September 5th. Uh, but anyway... That's been it for this week. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next week.